to all the people who say Dragon Ball is for kids. People have been telling me, oh, Dragon Ball is not for, and not for all the people. It's for kids. Well, so now the YouTube update finally got on the pace, and guess which movie is not listed for kids? Dragon Ball trailer is not listed for kids because, you know, if it really was listed for kids, you know, you can't save it to playlist, you can't download the video, and of course you cannot leave comments. So I think this is for sure that Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Super and all of Dragon Ball is not for kids, okay? Finally, I have evidence to finally debunk the whole notion that Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball is only for kids. Now, Dragon Ball is only for kids. It's the same exact trailer by Funimation. And you can see here, it's, there's comments and everything. So yes, Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. Finally, one good thing has finally come out of copper. Finally, I have debunked the whole notion. The whole notion that Dragon Ball is for kids. It's not for kids. I have finally, I finally have legitimate evidence. Of course, if you've seen this episode of Dragon Ball Z, especially the fight scenes, you'll know that Dragon Ball is not for kids. The Dragon Ball, this entire franchise is not for kids, okay? Dragon Ball is for the same audience for as Marvel, as, you know, Alita Battle Angel, as, you know, Joker, you know, same older people, okay? Mostly older people, of course, you know, kids still watch it, but kids still watch Marvel anyways, and Marvel is definitely not for kids. Because there's violence and there's people beating each other up. And Dragon Ball Z, specifically the swearing in Dragon Ball Z. Like PG-13 levels of swearing in Dragon Ball Z. As well as the word, the F word, the D word. You know, the word damn, the F word sometimes. You know, there's a lot of, you know, the S word or sit in Dragon Ball. Okay, I have saw it both times, you know, in this video, but. There's a lot of swear words in Dragon Ball Z specifically. Dragon Ball Super Boy does not really make swearing. But it's probably gave the movie a PG rating. Because apparently, you know, but you know, of course, you know, violence alone does not get, you know, anime violence does not give you apparently a PG 14 rating alone. But if see in Dragon Ball Super Boy, even that movie, there's a lot of, you know, violence, you know, being sort of, you know, People falling sort of into mountains and stuff, stuff that kids should not be seen. So, yes, Dragon Ball Super and Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball, especially the original Dragon Ball, can, no one can, uh, no one can really argue that the original Dragon Ball is not for kids, obviously, but Dragon Ball Z is not for kids, Dragon Ball Super is not for kids, and the entire franchise of Dragon Ball is not for kids. Even the games themselves are rated T for teen, even the games themselves, which of course have this, have, you know, there's not there's not a lot of cursing, but there is some cursing in Dragon Ball and the original Dragon Ball Z dub. So, yep, Dragon Ball is a fist. We have officially debunked Dragon Ball for kids. Uh, you know, I I I didn't know I didn't check if Dragon Ball was listed at all. But yes, I have proven once and for all that Dragon Ball, the entire franchise, is not for kids. So yeah, so we can rest easy and be assured that Dragon Ball Z is not, definitely not, for people under 13. So yes, drag it, yep, yeah, that, that's basically it, goodbye.